Kia vehicles equipped with a USB port allow you to play music from your own personal collection, like from a flash drive, MP3 player, or other USB device. With this feature, you can play your favorite driving music during long trips or just across town. In this video, we'll show you where the USB port is located, how to play off a flash drive, MP3 player, or other USB device, how to navigate through your music files and folders so you can play your favorite songs. Let's get started. The USB port is located here, next to the aux or auxiliary port. It's important to first start your Kia vehicle before connecting a device into the USB port. If a device is connected to the USB port and the vehicle is started afterwards, it may damage the device. To play music from a flash drive like this one is easy. Once the vehicle is running, simply insert the drive into the USB port like this. Now turn the audio system on. A USB icon will appear here on the display screen. There are several ways that you can navigate through your flash drive to find a song, repeat a favorite song, or play them in random order. You can scroll through the files on your flash drive by turning the Tune Enter button. The file names will be displayed on the screen. Turn it clockwise to display the next song, and counterclockwise to display the previous song. When you found that great song you want to play, just press the button to enter your selection. If you saved your music in folders by category, for instance dance, R&B, or rock music, then you'll first have to select the folder on the flash drive. To select a folder, press the Category Folder button up or down. When you found the folder you want, select it by pressing the Tune Enter button. The first song within that folder will automatically start playing. To find other songs in that folder, turn the Tune Enter button and press it when you found the song you want to hear. Press the Information button to see the file name, title, artist, album, and folder name. To play your music files in a random order, use the Random button here. It's the number one button, and the letters RDM appear on the display above it. Press the button once, and only files in a particular folder are played back in a random sequence. Press it again to stop random play. If you press and hold the button, all the files on the USB device are played back in a random sequence. Have a favorite song you want to hear again? Simply press the track down button. Or if you want to listen to the song that played before the current selection, press the button again within one second. To rewind the current song, simply hold the track button down. To advance to the next song, press the track up button once. When you want to fast forward through a song, press and hold this same button. For those songs you love to hear again and again, press the repeat button. It's the number two button and the letters RPT appear on the display above it. You can even repeat all songs within a folder by holding down this same button. To cancel repeat, press the button once more. And finally, the scan button allows you to play back the first 10 seconds of each song on the USB device. So you can sample the music before you listen to the whole song. When you hear the song you want to listen to in its entirety, just hit the scan button again. Remember that your Kia's USB port will only play authentic MP3 or WMA files. To operate an iPod using the vehicle's audio system buttons, you'll need a Kia iPod power cable, which can be purchased through your Kia dealership. Only on Kia vehicles equipped with the UVO in-vehicle communication and entertainment system can the cable provided by Apple be used to connect an iPod. Kia's available USB port letting you roll with your favorite tunes from your own personal music library. To help you get better acquainted with these and other features, always check your owner's manual for complete operating information and safety warnings.